Right, so this is a quick demo. I've just had the new wireless unit to connect with my thousand. So by the look of it, never used it before. Garmin thousand. Now if it's coming across, go to there. Assume you can add sensor. Shimano Di2. That seems dead easy. Come to the parts. This is an SMEWW01. This is the remote. Uh, what do you say? Wi-Fi signal sensor thing, isn't it? For it's going to go here on the back stay in line with this. Okay. Obviously, you need another wire. 150 mil. 16 pound for the wire. 46 quid for the little sender. Anywhere between 350 and 500 quid for that. Get some little sticky tabs and little what have you. So, anyway, let's get to it. Should be quite easy. I'm going to take my little tab breaker if this comes across very well. Just going to snap that out. Snap my new one in. Get the little unit. And snap that in. Snap that in. I'm gonna put it somewhere like there. Yeah, I'll put it there. Should I put it inside? I won't even put it inside. No, I don't like that. I'm going to put it on the outside. Anyway, so that's that part. As you can see, dead easy. It's not this connector out, it's not that in, boom, boom, boom. And then put it there. Okay, so. Select DI2 and it's found it. So we'll add. So it's added the sensor. Ideal. As you can see, it's got my heart rate, it's got my power meter, and it's automatic with my DI2. How easy is that? That is just got to be the easiest setup ever. So, anyway, I've got my ride set up as a jolly and an effort. I think on the effort I've got is set up to work my gears. Oh, beautiful. It's already got it in already. Look. It's on 9 of 11. Is it on 9 of 11? Hmm, no. Then again, ah, that's why it's thinking that, because obviously I've cleaned it and I got it in the wrong one. So now it's on 9 of 11 and 2 of 2, so it's on the front. So, if I just push that down onto 1, it's now on 1. Oh, this is lovely. What a simple system. Oh, okay, so... Uh, We'll go on to 11. Oh. Come on, baby. Oh, let me down there, didn't you? Right, it should be on 11. Anyway, let's take you back up to the top. Careful, Russ. Need to put that on. Oh, so it's, as you can see, one on one. How cool is that? That is probably the coolest thing I've ever seen in my life. And how long did that take? absolutely no time at all well done shimano well done garmin there you go easy simple guide right simple yeah a little uh, sticky bit of plastic like you do on any garmin type product the obviously being the shimano stick that to the back back of this you get your little tie obviously that looks pretty neat now the reason i couldn't get into my 11 speed was because it wasn't on the big ring and I've set it up so it doesn't go on there because ideally if you're in the first ring you shouldn't go down to the bottom and when you're in the first ring it doesn't go down to the bottom and I think when you're in the top ring it doesn't go to the top no point because you're just going to wear your gears out because it's like chains cross uh, cross a line isn't it but there you go so as you can see gear two and two two on the front on the back just do a quick shift up Right, one gear, two gears, three gears, four gears, five gears. 
There we go. Six and two. How good is that? Well impressed.